Well, we were, before we started shooting, we were looking at the ingredient list for this perfume, and you mm -hmm. said you didn't see any um, parabens in it. They're probably not going to be a preservative like that. I don't, I'm not a perfume chemist, so I don't know for sure what goes in there. But you probably don't need a preservative like in a product like that. Um, what I noticed about your particular, do you want to advertise your, your perfume here? <laughs> your Hermes perfume, is that it had a lot of uh, essential oils in it. And one hazard that I would have, they're probably not, they're probably less toxic than many of the things that are in commercial, commercially produced, conventionally produced personal care products. But people react very differently to essential oils. I know, for example, that I tried to shampoo at a new place and it happened to have peppermint oil in it, and I discovered that I react to peppermint oil. So um, when you switch to you know, natural products or organic products, keep in mind that there's no, there's no uh, clear criteria for what goes into organic or natural either. That standard is in the process of being defined by the natural products industry. Um, and people do react very differently to different chemicals. Um, and you know, essential oils are still chemicals and fairly complex ones at that.